Wah, wah. Hey, G. Wah, 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 wah. Yeah. Hey, I was thinking. Let's go make a one-speed video. Like, like discs. You know, one-speed discs, you know? Like the Polecat, the Berg. Heck, even like Garrett Gerthy's Sonic. Oh, hold on. I got a shift. Wah, 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 yeah. wah, 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 manual. Got manual transmission going. Wah, 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 yeah. wah, 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 wah. No, I want to do the Berg. No, I want to put the Berg on my channel. Okay, okay, okay. I'll let you put the Berg on your channel. I have a pretty sweet one-speed disc that I want to feature. So you do the popular Kool-Aid, my favorite disc, Berg, and I'll go ahead and feature the Halo Polecat. That'd be pretty sweet. See you when you get here. Hasta luego. local course I just picked up a really great disc <laughs> some may argue otherwise but come on a polecat halo plastic how can you not want that I have yet to throw this super deep flat rimmed feels odd for a forehand feels okay for a backhand who's thrown one of these who likes it who bags it <laughs> I think it's more of a trophy disc in my opinion, but we're going to throw it today and see how it goes. All right, hole one, 61 meters, 200 feet. First hole of the course, nine hole layout. You got to go through these trees, split the gap, keep it on the lawn, path and beyond is OB. Circle hit, skipped a little long, but shouldn't be a problem. Then again, I am putting with a pole cat. Oh, that barely went in. <laughs> yeah, it's pretty slick. The plastic is, is slick, especially brand new. So, uh, hole two, 90 meters, 295 feet. This is the longest hole on the course. Trying out a flex forehand. Okay, we just hit a tree. Oh well, team polecat. Team polecat, you hit a tree, brother. Okay, let's see how this does with an approach. 54 meters, 177 feet. Let's see if we can get it close. Ooh, almost rang it up. Ooh, -hoo -hoo. about dunked it. The signature lefty backhand. Okay, well my lefty backhand upshot looked great <laughs> but it still left me with a oh an uphill 25 footer if you came looking for perfect putting I don't think you'll find it on to the next one Hole three, 68 meters, 223 feet. Probably the signature hole on the course. You have this row of trees all the way down the fairway. You can go a forehand left, a backhand right, or in my case. So he's going for the polecat roller, wide style. <laughs> in hindsight, I don't know if this was Let's the best idea. This works out. Not to spoil anything. Ooh. But in my defense, it's a pretty good roller disc. I just kind of threw it bad. It I'm held bounce. pretty well. Yeah, I need to just learn, learn the cut angle. Ooh. 
I thought that was in. Woo! Pole cat for the win. So close. Boy, I almost threw that in. The tree was guarding me. Threw it long, but we hit the comebacker putt. If you're used to an overstable putter, it's not bad. If you're a spin putter and you have like a P2 or a uh, AVR of sorts, you might struggle putting with this thing, at least doing a one disc round. So good luck. Okay, hole four, 70 meters, 229 feet. Pretty straightforward hole as they all are. I'm on repeat here. Okay, being a forehand dominant player, I need to give the people what they want, a backhand. Not a lefty backhand because that's cheater backhand. Pull cat, right hand, backhand, through the right gap. See if we can get it. Close your eyes if you're squeamish. My right hand backhand still needs some work. But not bad. Made the gap Hit pretty the good, gap. so not bad. Tell us in the comments, does Parker look like overthrow disc golf? Let us know, doppelganger. He's handsome, I hope so, he's handsome. So I hit this gap, right hand, backhand. Not too shabby. Oh, Team Berg, what you doing way back here? Team Polecat. Oh, yeah. Boom. So put in the comments what you guys think we should do next for a versus battle. We're kind of doing the Polecat versus Berg here, even though it's a one-sided race. But what should our next video be? So close. You weren't lying about the lefty backhand from 22, 23. Uh, if it's shorter than that, it hits top. If it's longer, it hits the cage. So uh, a little more overstable than, I usually throw Novas. So you get what you get out of the pole cat. All right, we almost dunked the lefty backhand. Oh, geez, throwing discs at me. <laughs> Sorry, boy. <laughs> okay, on to the next one. Hole five, 46 meters, 151 feet, double Mando, gotta go straight up the middle. Man. Circle three bids only. It had pretty good trajectory to the basket, but Ooh. hit the tree. Close. Almost threw it in, but uh, not really. Tap it out. Let's just move on to the next hole. <laughs> Nicely done. Hole six, 61 meters, 200 feet. All right. On to hole six. They put in a nice bench now. Thrown from this corner of the park. A couple options to go up the gut around the edge or around right, right or left. I might have to do a little step out forehand putt here. Let's do it. Whoa, where am I going? I zinged it. It's a tad long. Hey, those one speeders. One speeders are too fast. All right, folks, fingers crossed. Let's see if uh, see if I can make one. Oh, miracles happen. Nicely done. Putter <laughs> Parker wrapped her legs. Okay, hole seven, 55 meters, 181 feet. Very gettable, very doable. Like a simple upshot for most. Wow. I think flattened out nice. Yeah. I, I like the integrity of the pull cat. Holds the line really well. Um, it does turn over on a forehand, but for backhand, it's pretty reliable, pretty stable. All right. For those that haven't noticed, G is doing a Berg only round. Catch that over on his channel, linked above. 
Come see some really awful putts, some way hyzered out turnovers. You might even see a couple birdies. Who's to say? Who's to say? Check out his channel, it's awesome. Gotta get my K1 or K3. Oh, you've seen it here first, folks. Two putts in a row with the polecat. Here we go. Miracles do happen. Hole 8, 62 meters, 204 feet. A lot of good mature trees here to throw through. A lot of different options. All right, hole 8. Here we go. No surprise. Throwing the polecat still. Let's yeah, do this. I still got the birds. Okay. So there's the lefty line, forehand turnover, backhand, a lot of good options. Forehand roller, I think we're just gonna go lefty backhand through the smaller gap. All right, a little low. Nothing we can't throw in though, right? Here we go. Not very magical there. Here we go. Oh, tickle, tickle. Ooh, the old behind the back. Here we go. All right, hole nine, 74 meters, 245 feet. Last hole of the course. Let's see how we do. I'm sick of hitting these trees. Had some good flight. Man. All right, hit the tree. Still a ways out. Let's see what we can do. Ooh, very nice. Oh, there we go. Yeah, polecat's not bad forehand. If you know it's going to be pretty net straight to left uh it's pretty good all right and that's a wrap uh halo polecat do i recommend it sure get one again it's a it's a great utility disc but it's more of a trophy disc buy one love it put it on your shelf if you want to bag it for kind of a, a gag, do it. It's pretty fun. Uh, G did a Berg only round. Go ahead to his channel and check out his Berg only round. We had a lot of fun today. It's really hot, 85 degrees, uh, but catch you on the next one. and go to your home. Maybe that might be a good thumbnail. Boom! Pole cat. Dun 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 dun. Pole cat only round. <laughs>